He finally met his granny. Right, chapter 16. Granny! Did Granny come with us? Did Granny come with us? So much has grown, but there are no roots, no herbs. This looks like a bit of a mess, doesn't it? Hey, he's what are you big. looking at, Jonathan? The garden is in disorder. Well, clean me up, then, you little brat. I want it to be right again, but I don't know how to do it. <laughs> Before I became prior, I thought the same about Kingsbridge. Well, what did you do? I cleaned up. Where do we start? Hmm. Oh, where do we start? Oh. Weeds! Oh, we start with the weeds. Hmm. Some plants are weeds, and must go before we can plant new seeds. What are weeds? You. They take away what the other plants need to grow. Light, water, room. What do we do? Pick them. Pluck them. Yeah. They look a lot like every other plant, so you need to learn how to tell them apart. Here, you see those? They look like bullies. They're called wood sorrel. Let's pluck only those for now. I'll do it. I'll do it. If you insist. Make sure to pull out all of the thin roots. And now what do I do? Pick more. Pick more. For plants to take root, the soil must be loose and fertile. So, may I dig now? I wonder what happened to Tom. Whether Tom's still around. Done. What's next? Or did he end? Did Tom pass away in book two? I don't remember. Or did he leave? I can't remember. I can't remember. Stay here. I'll be right back. He's gonna get seeds. Uh. Seeds, come on. Now, this, where did you put them? This place looks so deserted compared to uh, the previous books when we was here. Ah, here they are. The beech nuts you gave to Milius a long time ago. We gave we gave him the seeds, those um, beech nuts in book one. Now, if you hadn't have done given them to him, maybe you, he would have grown something else. I found I these nuts for you. Remember, Milius. You always said that one day there will be a beech tree growing here. I think it's about time. Yes. Yeah. If we didn't if we didn't get those nuts in book one, maybe what would have what if planted instead? It's possible, Ginger. I don't know. Some look ghosts. What? There's potential that some gingers could still be witches, just like some blondes and uh, brunettes. What did you bring? Do you remember Milius, a kind man with a warm smile? Well, he told me to give you this. Whoa. 
It's a seed! There's no guard here, Bucket. This monastery is a bit, um, it's kind of, kind of a bit busted, busted up. Now we just have there was a There was a fire here in the end of the second book. All right. Jack set the fire. Yeah, just wait, watch it. Yeah, just stand there and watch, watch it. It's not how it works. Um, how long? Too long for us to keep sitting here. Uh, that long. Some things take time. And only with patience will you receive your reward. Well, they thought it was his Why fault, do we though. have to do all these things if all we had to do is wait? Simply waiting would not have been enough, Jonathan. You just paved the way for things to take their course. They are happening right now. And in a few days' time, we will return and see the first green leaf of something new. Oh, um, is it God's reward? Maybe. Does he make things grow? What about the rest of the weeds? You made it. A little shit. No, I just planted the seed. Hmm. Now you can fetch some water from the rain barrel. Just pee on it. But that good. water's smelly. It's been there forever. There are many trees by the river. I bet that water's better. That's a longer walk, though. I don't mind. The distance is worth it. Maybe you're right. It is worth it. Let's walk together, then. But I'll carry the bucket. Yes, because I'm an old man and I don't want to carry a bucket. Later that day. Why isn't Remedius holding the sermon? What's gotten into shots, Philip? Shots, shots, shots. What has gotten into Philip? You can see that it's all a bit of a mess, isn't it? Jack's coming back, he's going to rebuild Our it. Our church lies in ruins. But all of this, these dire times, have revealed something important to us. Something that, until, maybe until today, I wasn't aware of. What do you mean? You've been praying in these ruins. But you've been praying like you always did, in humbleness. We don't need a church for prayer. Where else are we going to pray? The chapter house? The church is where God resides. God doesn't work in the ways we might assume. Today, Jonathan tended to our garden to make it beautiful again. And he told me of things I almost had forgotten. Good and evil are not in here or out there. They are within each of us. Mmm. Good and evil are within each of us. Yes, that's right. Ah. God made us in his image. Thus, we carry the godly spark within us. But we have witnessed that man can have the devil in his heart as well. Prayer needs no special place, for we are his church. Yes. In our actions, he exists. We are God's temple. No man is closer to God than any other man. Whether you pray in church or on the streets of our towns. Whether you're a man, 
woman, monk or bishop. Philip, look outside. You have to see them. You've got to see the horses and the colours. Jonathan. Who's coming? Who's coming? Now, what's going on? I'm, I heard noises and I went to look. Calm down. What happened? But the priest said they brought a miracle. Who? What? What priest? Step right up, brothers and sisters. For you are about to see something that will change your life. Who is that? They brought us a miracle. A miracle? Uh -huh. Don't be shy. There is no danger. Just awe that awaits you here. Ah, you must be Prior Philip. I am Brother Reynold. Ah, look, it's Jack and I have been sent by on. the Archbishop of Canterbury. Here is his letter, in case you have reasonable doubt. What's that statue? So there's like Jack, Ileana, there's a statue of the Holy Mary inside the cart. Beloved Kingsbridge, I hereby implore you to accept the grace of a weeping Madonna, for she has chosen Kingsbridge as her shrine. After the rumours of a miracle had come to my ears, I had called for the possession to see me. I then saw it with my own eyes. She's real. I've claimed the miracle her, the miracle for England, and had intended to retain her in Winchester. The guardians of the Madonna had convinced me otherwise. They have come to England only to support the rebuilding of Kingsbridge. You have my blessing, Philip of Kingsbridge. I expect you to restore your priory to the worthy of the worthy of the Holy Madonna. We've been charged to accompany the weeping Madonna. She is to replace the loss of your relic, Saint Adolphus the Martyr, who was taken from you, I hear, with brute force. What? On her travel from far away Africa, she has collected donations to reward Kingsbridge for your faith in her and in the Lord. I can't believe this. What is all this? You do believe. That is why she came. And that is why you shall witness her miracle for yourself today. The weeping Madonna came to me in a faraway land named Africa. A baptized Saracen was her former guardian. Please tell us more. Of course. My words shall prepare you for the sight of the holy Madonna. I knew not her powers or destination. Nevertheless, I carried her for many miles. Uh, excuse me. Don't interrupt. Many bore witness to her miracle before it dawned upon me. She wanted to go home, but where? It came to me in a dream. It was Kingsbridge. Hey! Shh! Shh! She said, You shall build me a new church in Kingsbridge! So we set off with the blessing of Archbishop Theobald and along the road from Paris across Normandy over the sea and all the devout Christians have given money for the That's building not fit of the for a shrine. Of the weeping I think Madonna. there's someone snoring in there. It's the baby. Strange. This church of Kingsbridge. Nothing safe. The baby's snoring in there. The weeping Madonna has chosen you, all of you. My dear people! Oh, oh, I'm so excited to see a true miracle. Did you hear that? The Madonna has chosen us! She's come all the way from Africa. Uh -oh. You must wonder. You don't need to be here, if it's too loud for you. 
Why was King's Bridge chosen to be the home of the Holy Virgin? Jonathan? They're about to show the miracle. Look! She said... You they look shall almost build me like a new horses. In Kingsbridge. So we set up horses with Hollow. fake. With the blessing Feels like a wicker basket covered in pelt. Fake humps. You heard me correctly. They are fake it was humps. A long journey. The weeping Madonna came to me in a faraway land named Tell me the Africa. truth. Why are you here? We are guardians of the Holy Virgin that sheds tears. We were appointed by the Archbishop of Canterbury, but it was the Holy Virgin herself who chose us while she travelled through Europe. Oh yes. How did that happen? She speaks without words. A baptised Saracen was her uh -huh. former guardian, and I and the custodians of the Holy Virgin were chosen to take her on a journey. Uh -huh. Baptised? A Saracen? You must wonder. Why was King's Bridge chosen to be the home of the Holy Virgin? She said, You shall build me a new church in Kingsbridge. So we set off with the blessing of Archbishop Theobald of Canterbury. The I, can I could have continued heart. to carry her from town to town there is much to until cost. my flesh succumbed. Not now. But this was not her will. But I wondered, what shrine should be her shelter? Were you just supposed to wait for him to finish talking or something? This time, it was the Madonna herself who answered my questions. And I will tell you again. She is a true miracle that will change your life as she changed mine. Many bore witness to her miracle before it dawned upon me. She wanted to go home, but where? Is he just repeating what he's saying? Francis it came to me in a dream. It was... There's obviously something we gotta do here. Why was King's Bridge chosen to be the home of the Holy Virgin? Brother Reynold. I've heard of a Reynold from the coast. A scheming drunkard who lives as a traveling monk. You think that's him? Perhaps it is, perhaps it's not. I don't trust him either way. Yeah, she it's said, a little bit fishy. So, what do you think of this procession? They seem well intended, Kingsbridge. and we could use the money. Hmm. So we set off. With oh, he's pretty obvious that he's fucking. Well, that's a kid! Still looking at the back! So it's pretty obvious who it is, right? But. And they know him, and he knows them. In the beginning, I knew you not. Her oh, hello. Or destination. Nevertheless, I carried her for many miles. I am Philip. Who are you, Why young man? King's <gasps> chosen to be the home of the Holy Virgin. She said, "Don't you, you want to see the miracle too?" A new church <laughs> in <laughs> Kingsbridge. So we set off with the blessing mm -hmm. of Archbishop Theobald of Canterbury. You heard me correctly. It was a long The weeping Madonna came to me in a faraway land named Africa. Can you feel it? Brothers and sisters, you are about to witness a me- A me- The Madonna knows how you have s the Virgin Mother had to witness the rise and fall of her son. Kingsbridge, Prior James left you before his time when you needed him the most. Your old cathedral was burned to the ground. How do you know this? And your new one collapsed even before construction was finished. You have yes, suffered. Somebody. The exactly. ruthless destruction of your market, homes, and lives. Dada. All of you have lost husbands, Dada. wives, and children, family, and friends. Dada. All of you know how it is to be hungry and a. Jack. Aliena. Philip. 
but this is a miracle, isn't it? Or something along those lines. But how? We thought it was time to give Tommy a home. The boy? Your boy? Well, Philip? Do you recognize him? Our little Tommy? Tommy? But... It's been almost three years since I last saw you, Jack. Where on earth did you find him? I'd almost given up looking for him. Then Tommy found him. And you decided to come back. Well, this is our home, after all. Then what on earth is all this? This miracle? With the Madonna, we were able to collect donations. For your priory and for Kingsbridge. Really? We can start anew. We can rebuild the cathedral. What's the catch? I'll get to be Master Builder. Why? I've studied the cathedrals, churches, and houses they build in France and Spain. I saw how different their constructions were, with new shapes, colors, and ideas. Oh, you should have seen it. They combined rib vaulting and pointed arches. I want to do that. That's why. Why here? Because this is home. The townspeople probably think that's enough to build a whole cathedral. But to me, it looks like about a hundred pounds. You know, that won't even pay for a year's work. Like all of this, it's a symbol. Enough for a fresh start. And the Madonna will stay here. Kingsbridge will attract visitors and donations again. You mean I should be thankful for these lies and tricks? Um... Jack! Aliena, you came back. We wanted to see you, little sister. Uh, how are you? Oh, I'm fine. But look at you. And the little one. Tommy. How are the others? Alfred left Kingsbridge. Richard shows up every now and then. And Ellen returned to the forest. We need to visit her. Father lives with her now. What's wrong, Martha? I'm glad you're back. I am too. Very glad. She looks like she's about to cry. She will weep for your suffering, Kingsbridge. She knows your pain. What now? The miracle. <laughs> the miracle. Her eyes are wet. <gasps> her eyes. Look at her. Heaven. They're shining. She cannot hold her tears any longer. She is made of wood. It's impossible. Why are you weeping? She is mute ever since her husband died. The Madonna has <gasps> suffered as I have. She understands. <laughs> It seems through her faith in all of your lies. Mary has found a miracle. We can't keep trying to repair Kingsbridge by ourselves. Things are not improving. We're struggling to keep things as they are. But we can't afford to hire help. Without farming and fairs, we're back to prior James's time. All these past years, my advice was good enough for you. But it appears you've changed your mind now, again. It is time we started doing something to wake up and make Kingsbridge what it used to be. We did before and we can do it again. That's right, let me just... I'm not willing to accept a risk like that. Tough. Don't you remember what happened last time? My, my. How easily we forget. I remember well. And still, you put your trust into a group of random strangers to make things better. Philip, why in God's name strangers. have you stood by and let this happen? 
They're tricking us into giving them money for false idols. They are giving us money. So that we'll place this idol in our pockets. priory? Do you approve of this? We'll go along with it. Pretty monies. People need hope. And these travelers are giving them hope. Yes, it is a deception, but with good intentions. Mary speaks again. Is that not a true miracle? You fell for them. You really did. And now you joyfully take part in their deceptions. I... I'm warning you. I cannot support a prior who tolerates heresy. Your threat won't sway me. No matter how unconventional, their return and their gift are a blessing. You made your decision, Philip of Gwyneth. And now, I make mine. I resign. I'm leaving the Priory. I... I don't think... I don't think people will be upset about that. Well, maybe they... Maybe some will, but... I'd have to guess that most won't. You got so big, Tommy. <laughs> and you're just as shy as your father was. Don't let him fool you. Usually, he's always up to something. Come to see Mom. And there's Tom. Tom the Builder. We are so proud of you. Of both of you. Is she still here? Hmm? Your wife, Agnes. No. Ellen and Martha moved her to Kingsbridge. She got a proper burial this time. Will you come back with us, too? Would you want that? Yes. I need your help with the cathedral. Philip and I have big plans. We'll come. Ellen, we found Jack's family in Cherbourg. The place he came from wasn't Cherbourg, it was Cherbourg. But, really? What were they like? French. They were good people. They were French. That says it all, really. His grandmother said Jack looked just like him, like his father. He does. But they never came for him or, or asked about him. They thought he was dead. His ship sunk. He'd always wanted to go to England. Have you ever heard of the White Ship? Uh, no. The King's family drowned. My father was there. He was the only one who survived. Not for long. You told me that he was accused of stealing a chalice. Yes, but, but I know he was innocent. I heard the story and had to find out what he looked like. He told me his name. I fell in love. I helped him escape. But in the end, they caught up with us. What happened then? They hanged him. Ooh. I was there. And you were there, Jack. But you weren't born yet. He was led to the gallows. Everyone was quiet. The people somehow knew he was not a thief. But I knew for sure. He told me. He was so afraid. He didn't want to die. I didn't want him to die. And I prayed. Then I heard his voice, quiet. As if the falling melody might wing and net dissever. At dusk the hunter took Pulled a lever. his prey Pulled a lever. his freedom now No! No! <laughs> you said that three men were responsible for father's death. Who were they? The Sheriff of Shiring. 
Percy Hamley, Prior James of Kingsbridge, and Archdeacon Waleran by God. They showed no mercy. Neither did I. I curse you! All of you! He will return to haunt you! One day, you will be judged for what you did. Your houses shall be consumed by fire. Your life shall end in pain and agony. You shall grow old in sadness and regret. Mm. The people they killed will return to haunt them. I promised them. Well, we welcome our new prior, Remigius. He helped to recover the bones of the saint of Kingsbridge, Adolphus, from the hands of thieves. Adolphus already rests safely in this great cathedral of Shiring. Our master builder Alfred promised me that it will only be a matter of a few years until the cathedral will be finished. And the Earl of Shiring has promised to support us. But he has not done so for himself. No, the Earl is not a selfish man. His mother, Lady Hamley, is sick. More and more, I feel the whole of England is suffering from a sickness. The sickness of war, poverty, and most of all, heathen, heathen beliefs. beliefs! I oh have spoken to God. I asked him, begged him to walk amongst us, to heal us. But God told me that only when this great cathedral is finished will he have a temple to reside in. No matter the cost, this shall be a towering castle to protect us from evil and false beliefs. Uh -huh. With this cathedral, we will bring an end to the dark times. Wailer and by God. Jack? What are you doing here? My father died by your hands, Waleran. His name was Jacques Cherbourg. How dare you talk to the bishop like that! He died right here! Who are you? I know that man. He's that bastard from Kingsbridge. That man is my husband. You? All of you. Listen to what we have to say. From now on, Kingsbridge is protected. By our knights, by our walls, and by the word of the king. So whatever you do, we will defend our town, our market and fulling mills. And our cathedral, which we shall rebuild. All workers are invited to come and work for us. Preposterous. If you so much as try to bring harm to us, Bishop, we will make sure that you pay for everything you did. Da -da -da. Well. Good old Alfred, right? Uh, we helped Jonathan Parler Tree. You've held your first summon in a long time, but you approved a deception of the Madonna. For it gives people hope. Eliana and Jack have returned to Kingsbridge. I mean, they have returned. Yes. Right. Let's go. Let's go.